Warfare has become so sophisticated that speed plays a major role in either defeat or victory. Bombers have continued to play strategic roles in combat operations, and their speed and stealthiness have remained a factor in many aerial combat operations. Below is a detailed discussion of each of these five bombers, their design histories, performance characteristics, roles and technological features that are often cited among the fastest and most capable strategic bombers in service today. Background and evolution. The Chinese H-6 bomber family is based on a Soviet design, the Tupolev Tu-16, that China first adapted in the 1950s. The Xi'an H-6K is one of the latest extensively modernized variants. It represents a significant upgrade over earlier versions, incorporating new engines, avionics and weapon integration systems. Performance and speed. While the Xi'an H-6K bomber is not supersonic in the modern sense, it is engineered for an optimal balance of range, payload, and moderately high subsonic speeds. Improvements in engine performance allow it to cruise faster than earlier variants, ensuring it remains an effective standoff platform capable of launching advanced anti-ship and land attack cruise missiles. Role and capabilities. This Chinese bomber is designed as a long-range nuclear and conventional strategic bomber. The Xi'an H-6K carries modern air-launched cruise missiles, its updated sensors and electronic warfare systems help it to operate in contested environments, while modernization efforts focus on improved reliability and longer-range strike capability. The Northrop Grumman B-2 Spirit This heavy strategic bomber is a US stealth aircraft developed during the final years of the Cold War. Its unique flying wing design minimizes radar cross-section, offering high survivability in high threat or contested environments. Although the B-2 Spirit is subsonic, with cruising speeds of around Mach 0.85 to Mach 0.95, its fast reputation comes from its ability to penetrate advanced air defenses undetected, rather than just raw speed. Its long endurance and fuel-efficient design allows it to maintain high speeds for extended missions, assisted by advanced flight control systems, fly-by-wire system, and avionics. Role and Capabilities Serving as a strategic platform, the B-2 Spirit can deliver both nuclear and conventional weapons. Its low observable design is complemented by advanced avionics and sensor fusion, enabling it to disrupt enemy network-centric defenses. The emphasis for this bomber is on stealth, range and precision rather than the need for supersonic performance. The B-1B Lancer Background and Evolution This bomber was originally envisioned as a supersonic bomber, the B-1A, during the 1970s, the design evolved into the B-1B Lancer after modifications that traded some speed for improved payload and lower observability. The B-1B Lancer entered service as a variable geometry multi-role bomber capable of both conventional and potential nuclear missions. Performance and speed, the B-1B Lancer can reach speeds exceeding Mach 1.2, making it one of the faster bombers in terms of pure kinetic performance. Its swing-wing design allows it to optimize performance across variable flight regimes high-speed dash, as well as long-range crews, roll and capabilities. The bomber is noted for its large payload capacity, high fuel efficiency in crews, and advanced avionics. Its ability to adjust wing sweep improves aerodynamic performance and fuel efficiency during low observable approaches and high-speed dash phases. Upgrades over time have improved its strike capabilities, precision engagement using modern munitions, and networked warfare integration. Background and Design Philosophy The Tu-22M series, especially the modernized Tu-22M3 variant, represents Russia's evolution of the supersonic maritime strike bomber. Developed during the Cold War, it has been continuously upgraded to serve as a fast, long-range and versatile bomber. Performance and Speed The Tu-22M3 is a variable sweep wing bomber with a maximum speed that can approach or exceed Mach 1.8 in a dash mode. Its design focuses on rapid transit to the target area, often to reduce exposure in contested airspaces and to deliver standoff munitions. Role and Capabilities Built for both anti-ship and land attack roles, it can carry a wide range of ordnance including cruise missiles and free-fall bombs. The Tu-22M3 bomber's robust design and long range allow it to contribute effectively to power projection, while modern avionics and targeting pods enhance its precision. Its performance and ability to carry out supersonic dashes make it one of the faster platforms in the Russian bomber fleet. The Tupolev Tu-160 bomber. Its background and design philosophy, nicknamed the White Swan, the Tu-160 
is the world's largest and fastest cruise missile carrier. It is a supersonic, variable-sweep wing strategic bomber developed during the late Cold War. Its design reflects a focus on speed, range, and payload, while integrating state-of-the-art avionics and navigation systems. Performance and speed. The TU-160 has a maximum speed of around Mach 2, with some estimates pushing just over Mach 2 in dash mode, making it the fastest among the bombers discussed here. Its powerful turbojet engines and aerodynamic optimized design allow for rapid high-altitude transits across intercontinental distances. The variable sweep wing configuration ensures efficient flight across different speed regimes, from subsonic cruise to supersonic dash phases. Roll and capabilities, serving as a key component of Russia's long-range nuclear deterrent, the Tu-160 can carry a mix of nuclear and conventional weapons, including a variety of precision-guided munitions. Its long-range strike capability, combined with high speed and altitude, allows it to breach modern air defenses. The bomber's advanced electronic warfare and countermeasures further enhance its survivability in complex threat environments. Summary and comparative overview. Speed versus stealth and roll. While bombers like the Tu-160 and B-1B emphasize pure kinetic performance and high-speed penetration, with the Tupolev Tu-160 being the fastest, platforms like the B-2 Spirit focus on ultra-low observability. The Tupolev Tu-22M3 bridges the gap between speed and payload versatility, suited for rapid strikes with precision munitions. The Chinese H-6K shows that even legacy platforms can be significantly modernized to remain operationally relevant in the modern era, offering an effective blend of range, payload, and improved performance. Technological evolution. Each of these aircraft illustrates a balancing act. From raw speed and payload in the case of the Tu-160 and B-1B to the stealth and low observable design of the B-2 Spirit and a mix of modernization and traditional design in the H-6K. They embody decades of aerospace evolution driven by the need for rapid global strike capability, survivability in heavily defended airspace and adaptability to a wide range of mission profiles. The five bombers discussed, the Xi'an H-6K, B-2 Spirit, B-1B Lancer, Tupolev Tu-22M3 and Tupolev Tu-160, each represent distinct strategic philosophies. Their designs reflect trade-offs among speed, stealth, payload and range, contributing to the overall global balance of power and the ability to project force over vast distances under challenging conditions it can be observed that there are three major powers wielding strength and technological prowess when it comes to aerial combat. These countries are the US, Russia, and China. In the International Global Firepower Assessment, these three countries tower well above others, in both the weaponry they possess and in their annual defense spending.